today we will quickly learn how we can log into safe mode in windows 10 so it doesn't matter if your if your uh, laptops company is dell or hp or lenovo or whatever uh, we'll just do it using windows default methods so first we'll learn how you can log in to safe mode uh, start your computer in safe mode if you cannot log in or if you are stuck on lock screen and then we'll see how we can start windows into safe mode if you're logged in or you have a blank screen or any other reason like i'm currently on my screen now we'll see how we can log into safe mode okay let's see how we can do this first if we are logged if you cannot log in so i'll go to my lock screen now from here what you can do is now if i click on this then then the screen recording will not be visible so the thing is uh if it is visible i press shift and then i press this power button and then i just restart okay and then Okay, so now we will see how we can do this if you are already logged in or you want to start Windows in safe mode during a restart. Okay, so what you can do is press Windows plus R and then type MSCONFIG. Okay, hit enter and then go to boot and then just click on safe mode. Sorry, safe boot and then uh, by default this minimum is selected and if you want no GUI then click on no GUI also. And if you want uh, networking, if you want network to be enabled, like if you want network access like Wi-Fi or LAN, then just click on network. Otherwise, just hit on minimal and then click apply. Okay, and then click OK. And then you can just restart here and your laptop will restart and you will be opened into safe mode. Or you can exit without restart and restart later on at your own time. But then also your PC will be started in safe mode. Okay, so that's second method and for me, I'll disable this because it's no use right now. My laptop is all working well. So yeah, that's it guys. We, we saw two methods of starting Windows into safe mode and share, hit like and subscribe if, you, if this uh, video helped you. Thanks a lot.